morning, everyone. And now here's all the news that you can use on ONN, the OWL News Network. This morning we welcome Miss Badijo's first grade class. Aiden, what a wonderful group of students. Wow! Everyone please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge, pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now Ms. B Ms. Badija will lead her class in the patriotic song, followed by the character pledge and the always exciting class presentation. Seuss. Hi, my name is Andrew. Theodore Seuss Giselle was an American children's author, political cartoonist, and animator. Hi, my name is McKenna. He is known for his work writing and illustrating more than 60 books under the pen name Dr. Seuss. Hi. Hi, my name is Alexander. His work includes many of the most popular children's books of all time, selling over 600 million copies and being translated into more than 20 languages. Hi, my name is Dahlia. He published his first children's book, and to think that I saw it on Mulberry Street in 1947. Hello. Hello, this is Musa. During World War II, he took a break from children literature to illustrate political cartoons. Hi, my name is Bethany. He also worked in the animation and film department of the United States Army where he wrote, produced, or animated many productions. After the war, Giselle returned writing children's books, writing classics like... Hi, my name is Delaney. If I ran the zoo, or in here's a who. If I ran the circus, the cat in the hat, how the Grinch stole Christmas, and green eggs and ham. Hi, my name is Iwana. He published over 60 books during his career, career which had spawned numerous adaptations. Hi, my name is Alice. 
These include 11 television specials, 5 feature films, a Broadway musical, and full television series. Giselle won the Lewis Carroll Shelf Award in 1958 for Horton Hatches the Egg, and again in 1961 for And to Think That I Saw It in Mulberry Street. Hi, my name is Joe Quinn. He celebrated, um, we celebrate Dr. Susan birthday March 2nd. Hi, my name is Habiba. This day has been adopted as the annual date for National Reading Across America Day in Initiative on Reading Across Creating Created by the National Education Association. Here are, oh, hi, my, my name is Jacob. Here are some fans' quotes from his books. Hi, my name is Ali. Maybe Christmas, the Grinch thought doesn't come from a store. Don't, hi, my name is Riley. Don't cry because it's always small because it happened. Hi, my name is Ishan. Today, you are you. That is truer than true. There is no one alive who is you than you. A person's a person no matter how small. You're never too old, too wacky, too wild to pick up a book and read to a child. That was a wonderful presentation. Let's give this class a round of applause. And now here's Hayden from the fifth grade with all the news. Our eighth annual George Washington Day was held on our campus last Friday, and we did have fun. We got to see the third and fourth graders showing off their skills as they danced the Cumberland Square on the Virginia Reel. Then students in three through five portrayed the 45 presidents of the United States in the Hall of Presidents. That was impressive. Did you get a chance to see our youngest patriots, our preschoolers, marching around the field and playing their drums? They were so cute and everyone did a fine job. Later we got to visit the authentic Yorktown encampment and then we entered the Colonial Street to sample President Washington's favorite lemonade and see exhibits of early American trades. We even got to make some crafts, projects, solve secrets of codes, and play games that the colonial children played. The day was topped off by viewing the marvelous new Lego portrait of George Washington, created by Miss Jenkins' art students. Everything was outstanding, and we loved eating ice cream and cherry pie at the end of the program. We wish to give a special thanks to all the people who helped make our, edu make our day so educational and exciting, and especially we want to thank Mr. Mark, Mr. Kim, Mr. Rob Gerald, and all our wonderful teachers, and our terrific Genesis parent group. That's all. Wow. wow! Yesterday, all the Genesis students got to watch the famous Tricky Dog Show. That was so much fun. And that reminds me, don't forget to come to the Strawberry Festival tomorrow in downtown Newport Ritchie. This will benefit Genesis School's own Cindy's Pets. So we hope to see everyone there. There will, be a there will be bouncy houses and all kinds of fun things to do in the kids' zone at the festival, as well as games, boots, strawberry shortcakes, and other goodies to eat. Don't forget to enter your favorite dog in the exciting dog show. All the fun will begin at 10 a.m. tomorrow. This afternoon, Genesis students will show off their jump rope skills at the annual Jump Rope for Heart Assembly. The fun will begin at 2 p.m. on the basketball court. See you there. Now that's a triple. Wow, wow, wow! Thank you, Hayden. You gave a terrific news report. And now here's Kaya from the second grade with today's weather. This week 
weekend will be beautiful. Come out to Cindy's Pets Strawberry Festival and enjoy the weather. Thank you, Kaya. We'll end our broadcast by singing our school song and saying our cheery spirit cheer. Is everybody ready in the classes? Yes! Is everyone ready in the studio? Yes! Thanks for watching, going in. Bye! Bye.